guys, it's me, Melissa, and welcome back to my channel. Today we are here for another edition of Sub Love, January 2021, the first Sub Love of the new year. Um, if you don't know what Sub Love is, it's when I open up things that you guys send me to my P.O. Box um, and open them on camera to show you guys. Um, my P.O. Box is always down in the description box. You don't have to send me anything. This is not like something you need to do. I am super thankful. I'm still surprised that people want to send me things. It just puts me over the moon. Like, it, it's whenever they say I have a package, I'm just like, really? <laughs> Who sent me something? <laughs> okay, so without further ado, I'm going to go in the order I received them. Coming in hot. <laughs> Amelia Jane, again, sent another package from Australia. I'm wearing the shirt that she sent me in the last one. Amelia Jane is on that sub love game, <laughs> for sure. One thing I thought was funny... I don't, she probably didn't mean to do this, but look, it says the cheap trick <laughs> instead of the cheap chick. She probably was just writing it and like, you know, the cheap trick, I think, is actually a a, a band, or I think. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's take a look and see what Amelia Jane sent this time. She is super duper sweet. I can just imagine how much it costs shipping these big huge packages from Australia. Like, Australia. I'm using the coasters right now you sent me last time downstairs. So let's see. So we got Tim Tams here. We got some dark Tim Tams. And don't worry, I brought some tea. We're going to do a Tim Tam Slam. But first, let's see what we got. We can see which one we want uh, to open up and test out. So we got the dark chocolate Tim Tam. I know a lot of you guys said that you get Tim Tams in Walmart or some, some places. But I know you can't get, like, all the flavors. And in Australia, they have, like, a wide variety of flavors you can get. Like, she sent me this list, and I was like, Really? And this is the Sunshine Coast Strawberries and Cream. These are delicious. The strawberry ones she sent the other time, I hoovered those things like it was going out of style. <laughs> Hoover. <laughs> All right. And now we got some Tim Tam White. I think I actually gave these ones to my mom because she does like white chocolate too. But we'll see which ones will taste out. Holy Tim Tams. And then we got Cadbury Magical Elves. 12 Elves. Cadbury in every other country besides here is so delicious. Cadbury Elves. So the package is like this. Let's take a look at these little elves. Twelve elves. So they're just chocolate elves. It broke in half. Are there crunchies in there? I think they're eh, popping candy. Popping candy. Solid milk chocolate with magical popping candy. Such good chocolate. I should rub my tea over. Let me grab my tea. Papa's now over there sniffing everything. Continuing on, I see some more Tim Tams. <laughs> Holy Tim Tam. This is the double chocolate caramel and cream flavor. Now, I guess you guys that live in the United States, tell me if you've seen all these flavors here, because I feel like some of these you definitely can't get. I'm not sure what I'm going to slam with. Now we got Mukaya Manuka Honey and Cream. Look at honey and cream. Holy Tim Tams. My parents are coming over in a couple days for their monthly visit. So it's going to be like a Tim tam -a Murray River Salted Caramel. I bet my mom really like that. She loves like caramel things. Holy Tim Tams. Wait, is there a note in here? Hold on. I missed the note. Dear Melissa and family, a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Congrats on 20K. Woo, yay. I'm sorry this parcel has taken a while to get to you guys. Understandably. We've had just been flat out of uh, out with kids things. My daughter, who is 12, just finished uh, year six, and we had formals, presentations, and graduations, farewells. She starts high school next year. My son, who is 16, had formals and presentations. The both won medals this year. Oh, that's awesome. My son won it for school service and my daughter won it for outstanding learning disposition in class. That's awesome. We have ha also had dance concerts, dance rehearsals, dance photo days, cheer tryouts, etc. as well. It's been so very busy. So in this parcel, I've sent Paco a little something from, from my dogs. They are Australian Kelpies. Their names are Chocolate Female and Biscuit Male. I hope he enjoys the treats. Now I have been to every shop and grabbed every flavor of Tim Pam we have on the market at the moment. 
There may be a few double ups, but I thought mom and dad can take them home. Tell them to put them in the fridge and they taste way better cold. Also popped in a packet of Christmas elves popping chocolates. That was good. They are so good. They are. Well, enjoy your Christmas and I'm hoping dad and mom can be in the next video and try these Tim Tams on camera. I'm sorry I couldn't get them here today, <clears throat> but I'm going to be filming some videos with them when they come over. Hopefully, um, it's just hard to get them here like on the times when I have every single time. What else we got in here? Oh, a special treat for Paco. Chocolate and biscuits, awesome, awesome Kelpies. Love them. This is, hold on, let me get this thing off. Chicken training treats, which is perfect because I've started only giving Paco <coughs> training treats because he, if I give him big things, he starts like choking. Like he swallows them way too fast. He's right here. Let me get this open and then I'll film it giving him one. So here it is. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm not sure if he'll eat it up here because he doesn't usually get treats on the bed. But, do you want your treat? The treat. Oh, I slipped through it. Where is it? Where is it? He'll eat it. We'll put it in his bed with him. We'll put it over here and see if he eats it. And there he goes. <laughs> he just had to break it in pieces. And truthfully, we were actually getting low on treats, so that comes in clutch right now. I was about to place an order on Amazon. Thank you, Amelia Jane. And then, Tim Tam's Chocolate Mint. Delicious. I am Tim Tam'd up to the Tim Tam end of time. Gibbsborn Orange and Dark Chocolate. I bet my mom would like that too. So now, for the Tim Tam Slam. What are we gonna use? I think I want to try this double chocolate caramel cream flavor. I didn't put it in the fridge like you told me. I did not. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let me find one. Taco is being super annoying sitting right next to me. <laughs> you can like smell the caramel. Hold on. Let me get it back in the package so Taco doesn't get it. So they like this. So you're supposed to bite one side, bite the other side, and then suck through it. A bit, a little extra off. Oh, chocolate down. This is how I actually used to drink my tea in Rhode Island with like milk and sugar, but now I just drink like black tea straight. I just spilled a whole bunch of tea. <laughs> I'm just gonna dip it. <laughs> There's so much tea on the bed. This is way too high. <laughs> mm. Dipping is really good. Mmm. Mmm. I wanna clean this up and taste another flavor. I just totally like so easy to make a mess. Now I really want to try this one, the honey one, because that's different. I'm just going to take a bite of it first. I do taste honey. Now let's see how it, how it goes in a little tea action. Yeah, it does taste like honey. Crazy. Mmm. I don't really know why I haven't had tea like this in forever. Probably because I never have milk. I actually have milk right now. Mmm. So good. Like, these are dangerous. Like, dangerous. Delicious. So, thank you so much, Amelia Jane. You have just, like, overdone it with setting sub love. Buy yourself some snacks. I'm super appreciative. My parents, when they come over on the 31st, are going to be like, holy Tim tam -a -thum. I'll make sure my dad, I'll tell him to bring some coffee over. I can even make some tea. We can do some Tim Tam slams or something. <laughs> so thank you so very much, Amelia Jane. That was super duper sweet of you. 
Now, I'm gonna go in the order I received. Um, this one I have no clue. It didn't have anybody's name on it, so if there's something inside that says who's from, I'll, I'll let you know. If not, and you send it to me, please let me know, because I would love to send my special thanks to you. Came just like this in a package like this. And what do we got? Oh my gosh. I love you to the moon and back. Oh, look at that with a chihuahua. <laughs> Hello, Paco. I could be your little brother or sister. He's like, what do you want me to look at? Look how cute this is. Who sent me this? Who sent me this? It's so cute. I love it so much. Oh my gosh, I can see myself wearing this to bed like all the time. I love chihuahuas. They really are the cutest things like in the world, like in the world. I love all animals, but chihuahuas, they got my heart. So thank you so very much whoever sent this. Please let me know. I love it. I think it's the cutest thing. Look it up close. Ever. Look at that. Look how realistic. <laughs> oh, that is so sweet. So sweet. Now, the next package comes from Cece, and Cece, um, I actually know she was sending something, and she actually does have two channels of her own, and so I will link them down in the description box. Let me get inside of it. Let's see if she wrote a, a note or anything. Yep, there's a note in here. So I'm going to get the note out first. Okay to read on camera. Dear Melissa, hey girl, Cece here. I love your videos. You have a you have saved me from making a horrible mistakes on several occasions by buying something that would have turned out to be crap. So thank you. The keychains in your package are M and lavender opal. Ooh, the other is a self defense keychain. You put your fingers and in, in index middle finger inside the holes and stab it with and stab with it. <laughs> the bottom should you need to protect yourself. My Etsy store is and it's, it's CC's MT Creations. And then she put her YouTube makeup channel on here also. And she has a paranormal channel also. So I'm going to probably, I'll link all this stuff on there. My makeup channel is a little stagnant and I'd love for it to grow. But my paranormal channel is doing okay, I guess. But I'd like it, it to grow as well. As I am writing this, I am still waiting for my Miss A order to be filled. Well, I'll be let you, I'll let you get back to your other sub love. I'd love if you told your viewers about my Etsy store, which I did, and I'll link it down there, and both YouTube channels or whatever they're liking, makeup or paranormal. Love, laughter, and happiness, CC. And Chloe Loretta Lynn. P.S. Kisses Paco, pa kiss Paco's little face for me. Come here, she wants you to kiss you. Mm -hmm. That's from CC. <laughs> all right, CC. So yes, I'll link all of her stuff down in the description box for her channels. And her Etsy store. Oh, look at this. I like this. Look how glittery and shiny. Did you make this? Oh my god. That's cute. That is super cute. One of my um key thingies. Key thingies. I had I had I had like the patron saint of travel on my thing and it fell off and then my aunt told me the patron saint of travel isn't a thing anymore. <laughs> So maybe I'll put this on my keychain instead. <laughs> Thank you very much, CC. Wow. This is no joke of self-defense. <laughs> you put your things in here. Um, I had a self-defense one that was a cat. And I got it in that self-defense hall like forever, ever ago. And when we went on the cruise, they took it from me. <laughs> And they kept saying, what is this, ma'am? What is this, ma'am? And I didn't think, I, I literally forgot that it was even on my keys. Like, I literally was like, I don't know what you're talking about. There's nothing in there that's bad. Then they held the thing and I was like, oh, sorry. And they took it. <laughs> but this one looks a little more like you wouldn't know it was for self-defense. Like, I guess that one did. It was small, but they took it from me. <laughs> so, no, if you're going on a cruise, don't bring any self-defense keychains. They might be taking them from you. <laughs> but yeah, that's a... I could take an eye out. <laughs> Thank you so very much, Cece. That is so super sweet of you. I really, really appreciate it. I, I guess you must you must make these, obviously, right? I'll have to check out your Etsy store, too. And also know that anytime I get cards or letters or anything, I do save every single one of these. And 
in my little sub love box, which actually the last sub love a subscriber made me a sub love box to put my sub love letters in it, and I am loving it. <laughs> and for our final package today, this comes from Krista, and it's coming from Ontario, Canada. I know what this is. We chatted about it. She makes all these things, like crochets, all this stuff. She doesn't even like sell them. Like she just does it in her free time because she likes to like pass the time and something to keep her mind busy. And so on her Instagram, she was show she was sending me on, on Instagram all the things she was making. And one of them was Baby Yoda, aka Grogu, aka the child. And I was like, oh my gosh, we love Mandalorian. Rob loves the child, Grogu. And she's like, oh, well, let me send you some. <laughs> so it's a keychain <laughs> with Baby Yoda. Are you kidding me? Look at this. Like, she made this. She made so many. I asked her if she wanted me to post her um, Instagram on here. And she said, no, don't worry about that. And I was like, are you kidding me? Like, you could be making so much money off this stuff. She She's made, like, every day she's, like, making some new project. So we got two of them. So cute. Oh, and it comes out. I'm going to give one to Rob, and I'm going to keep the other one upstairs in my room. It, I mean, if you like that show, then you obviously know what I'm talking about. This is the little thing that he floats around in until towards the end when, you know, it gets, like, blown up, I think. <laughs> but so cute. Love it so, so much, Christian. You're the best. I think that this is the most adorable thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> and the fact that you could make this, if it came down to nitty-gritty and you were like, Melissa... Knit this thing or dead. I'd be dead. I'd be dead. I could not do this. I love to see all the talent that you guys have to offer. Because, and you would think it would make me feel bad because I am not talented in that way. But no, it just makes me feel so proud. Like, I'm like, wow. Like, look at all that stuff that people can do. Like, there's so many different possibilities of being, like, crafty. I have none of them. But still, there's so many different, like, alleyways you could go to. So I'm super, super thankful to all of you. I really, really appreciate it. Like, it warms my heart. But like I said, you don't have to ever send me anything. This is not something that, anything or whatever. But I really do appreciate it. And I love being able to do these videos. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or any questions, please put them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you haven't yet subscribed, could today be the day? You want you want to see Paco? Maybe he'll make you it. Huh? Subscribe. Subscribe. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye.